Okay, you need to go. Okay, hopefully you can go up and down these faster. I need to figure out where these go. Oh, God, you went down it fast. Okay. Okay. What about, like, can I change my stuff, though? Email terminal, Sam. What about my, yeah, my loadout. That's what I'm looking for. I can't change my loadout. Can I change my loadout before? Verifying my connection from Hyperion to the Tempest. The Nexus confirms we're free to depart. Yeah, like, can I just change my loadout, like, beforehand? Like, before a mission, I assume? I hope. I don't want to go into a mission and be like, yeah, you can't do that. Because reasons. Okay, let's see what's going on. Wake my hand up a little bit. I can actually shoot people. Does it really look that awesome? I saw the view from literally just a little bit down below. I like that view better. Departure trajectory locked, Nexus Control. Ah, time for introductions. Hello, how are you? You must be Ryder, Gallo Jav. A pleasure to be here, and to meet you, of course. Uh, likewise. I'll be piloting the Tempest at your word. Quite the ship, but it'll take a Pathfinder's guidance to see us through Helios. Sure, sure. Hmm. Um, should I sound certain or uncertain? Let's do uncertain. I'm new to this. Being a Pathfinder running a ship? You'll be fine. As for the ship, I can help. I knew the Tempest when she was a blueprint. Ooh. I was test pilot for the Tempest's early prototypes. I admit, I'm itching to see how she performs <laughs> out here. Oh, that dude is so freaking like wanting things. It's unbelievable. So how do I... The console syncs with your implant. Just, Just swipe, swipe, touch a destination here, and the nav system calculates everything. Very efficient. I like this guy. It was I optimized do. for a Pathfinder. Everything's secure if you're ready. Is anyone ready for something this big? You know what? No, we got to be got to be good. I guess we have to be. All right. Excuse me. Excuse me. Yeah. <laughs> You're excused, Command dude. Command access is 100%. transferring successfully. Uh, science and monitoring stations look fine. Lexi's reporting in. Okay. Helm is green. Gil reports the drive core is online. This is it, Ryder. The Tempest <laughs> is yours. Unless you've got something to say for the log. Ugh. Keep dreaming of home. Yep. We were all expecting a golden world. <laughs> now there's just a long road ahead. But hold on to that dream. It might see us through. Nexus Control, this is the Tempest, Ident 2527, prepping to depart. Ident 2527. No idea what that means, but awesome. Alright, let's do this. Everyone watch as she goes, except for that one dude. Oh no, he goes too. Okay, he watches too. Make <laughs> sure. Departure vector verified, Tempest. Godspeed, Pathfinder. Yep, thanks a lot. Thanks a lot. So where to first? Well, Eos, of course. We need to, uh... Oh, Eos, then. What would have been our Habitat 1? Two failed outposts put an end to that idea. Maybe we can turn things around. Mm. Callow, take us in. We gotta do it. Apparently we're still going by Pfeiffer, though. Hmm. Like I'm thinking, right? You can go there. Let's 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 go there first. We have to go over there anyway, so there's no harm in it. Ooh, what is that? Who was that? Who was that? Ooh, he came and sneaks out of the mouse right now. This is about as far as the Nexus surveyors could get before. Well, let's see what's waiting here. Yeah, I like that idea. Let's see what's here first. Anomaly um, on A black hole. It is there. Shaboosh. Probe away. Tracking a huge mineral deposit. Oh. Take it. Take it. Activate scanner. 
Oh wait, can I just do it? That's an that's an asteroid, dude. I'm gonna mine the crap out of it. I'm assuming. I think. How many times I have to say I am very satisfied with what I with my purchase of this desktop though. Not even using an OG like I'm using my own. I love it. Whoa. Aluminum deposit? Do it. Like, is there any reason for me to care about this? Or. Oh, wait, it's blinking. Wait, it's blinking, though. So I'm confused about. Okay, do I need to match up so when they're all doing a nice pretty blink or what? Like, is there a thing here or am I just going around and looking at all of its angles for no raisin? I think I'm not getting any raisins from this. That's fine. Time to go back. That one was seen. I kind of want to go in that. Okay, I'll leave the black hole for now. Let's go over here. Go around the asteroid and just head to that planet. Not. Okay, went through the asteroid. That works too. Oh, okay, there it is. Oh, geez, it's like Mass Effect. This is like Mass Effect 3. We'll see. Oh, it's Mass Effect 3. Oh, poopy. Like, what the hell do those blinking lights mean? Like, I don't get what those blinking lights mean. Like, is there anything here? I guess not. I don't... I guess not? Okay. I keep going around until I figure out what I'm doing, because I have no idea what the hell I'm doing. H480. Okay, just to the right, left. I'm very good on my lefts and rights very well. Is that you over there? Ooh, there's you right there. You in that weird star. Is that a... Oh, I thought it was like a sun. Yeah, like, uh, this dust cloud. Hospitable even for well equipped Krogan explorers. Damn. Okay, now we're gonna head over to. Rayer. Ray. Rayer. Yes. Yes, yes. Raya. Someone went. Dude, someone went click click on the, some key somewhere. Oh. Going around and around, any reason? Anything good? It's highly toxic. Appears helium rich, it appears to be an host of enormous colonies of fungal spores. Well, they definitely ain't going anywhere around there. Now it is H461. Apparently they apparently they're doing the Frieza style of naming to where they're just giving it numbers. Like Frieza planet. F4, I think it was 491. Probably not. It was has Saturn rings. Uh, anything of interest? N nothing. Damn. Okay, two more. H479. And then apparently we're gonna just go straight into a damn black hole over there. Not sure that's safe, but okay. If they want to do it, hey, that's cool with me. I mean, I could stop them, technically, but... Wow, this looks like... That looks like an Earth 2. At least from the outside, it has water and stuff. Oh. Oh no, this has electric clouds. Extreme radioactivity and high-velocity winds. 
So they'd have to... So before they do something like this, they'd have to be able to tackle all that. And if they do, then it would be a good one, essentially. What they're saying. Alright. Uh, let's go explore this black hole, I guess. <laughs> I mean, I don't get the idea, but hey, why not? Explore the crap out of this black hole. We get, uh, that, is that, okay, I guess it makes sense as close as we're getting to a black hole after all. Uh, oh. A black hole. <laughs> Ship systems, the acceleration, the ass, 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 ass disk around, it's, around it is composed of the remains of at least one solar system destroyed by the black hole's formation and gravitational pull caution is advised. Well then let's get the hell out of here. I'm gonna, I'm gonna take a second. I'm gonna take a second. Oh. Oh, okay. We're just standing in front of a black hole. Don't worry. We can survive another eight years, don't worry. <laughs>